Hey, lizard people. So let's talk about how many crickets to feed your bearded dragons. So the quick answer to this is the average bearded dragon should be offered around 10 crickets per meal and around 20 crickets every other day in a single feeding um, at the most. So adults are going to eat around 50 uh, insects in a week, crickets if that's what um, you're choosing to feed them and what we're talking about here. But for babies or juvenile dragons, they're going to eat more per day and be fed more frequently. So let's talk about the amount of crickets by age and the frequency you should feed them. So the following strategy can work for every type of bearded dragon. Uh, when feeding your dragon, you should feed them as much as they'll eat within 15 minutes. Uh, the crickets they should eat should be smaller than the distance between their eyes. Uh, this is going to prevent choking and getting impaction um, when the food is too large. And this is a, um, this type of health issue is severe pain and a bad and terrible way for them to, to pass. Um, which, it won't always kill them, but it's a potential for death. Um, other than that, it's just, it can be extremely painful with the other uh, health problems that it causes. Um, but, so by feeding in this manner, you're going to prevent them from overeating and uh, this is gonna. This is overeating. Usually happens whenever you feed them too often, or if you're just feeding gradually over the day. Um, so all of these numbers are gonna be assuming your bearded dra dragon is at a spe uh, specified age. So exactly how many crickets um, in a day? An adult bearded dragon should eat as much as they can within 15 minutes. Um, it, this usually works out to be around 10 crickets uh, fed once per day or 20 crickets if fed every other day. Uh, if you follow uh, our recommended feeding schedule, which I'll talk about here in a bit, uh, you'll feed them around 20 insects every third day. The younger they are, this number is going to change. So how many crickets at one single time or one single feeding? Uh, bearded dragons should eat as much as they can at one time. There's really no exact number for this, and it's going to depend on the age of your dragon and the situation. Uh, so, for, And for those that are force feeding, don't force feed more than 10 crickets at a time with an adult bearded dragon. And, you know, just a word of caution here, force feeding isn't something to be done lightly. Um, even with our guidelines on it, uh, you should always consult with a vet before doing anything like force feeding. Uh, it's a... Um, and it, it's really, really something you should really try to avoid. But in some uh, special circumstances, it can be required. But always consult a vet before you force feed. So for baby bearded dragons, you're usually the, um, this is going to consist of um, dragons between uh, their birth and three months of age. So for these dragons, you're going to feed them as many crickets as they'll eat in one 10-minute span of time. Um, for many, this is as low as one cricket and up to 20 at the most in one sitting. Um, so believe it or not, the higher numbers are more common for these growing pets um, compared to their, the adults. So uh, baby bearded dragons need to eat more protein than their adults in their diet. So, and this is often why um, even just by placing insects out, in, uh, the younger ones tend to be more um, active in, in choosing uh, protein over vegetables. Um, so you may need, and you also, you're going to have to feed them possibly up to five times in one day. Uh, so, and, don't, and once you do that, don't leave the crickets in there once the 10 minutes frame has passed and let them eat as they will. Um, the biggest thing to worry about with baby breeder dragons is making sure the crickets are no larger than the space between their eyes. Uh, this is a common theme I'll keep bringing up because it's so important. Um, so like I said, so just to recap on this, you know, from birth to three months of age, um, you feed them as much as you can in a 10 minute span. It's going to be between one to 20 crickets. Um, and then, um, you're going to feed them roughly five times a day up uh, in that 10 minute time frame. And then, uh, you know, always check on the size of the insect you're feeding them. So for baby dragons and their daily limit, expect up, expect up to five feedings per day and between 30 and 80 crickets per day. However, the crickets will need to be much smaller and the feedings are going to be spread out um, compared to like an adult size um, crickets that, you know, because you're trying to keep it, as we keep mentioning, smaller than the space between their eyes. Um, so their crickets are much smaller. That's why the, the 30 to 80 sounds like a lot, but the, the insects are just a lot smaller. 
So now let's talk about juvenile bearded dragons and how much to feed them. So for juvenile dragons, they're often going. This is going to be considered between three months and up to a year. Uh, some bearded dragons reach adulthood around eight months, while others take a full year or sometimes a bit longer. So a good rule of thumb with this is um, is to look at their size and when it stops growing and sexual maturity. Look for brumation, uh, like hibernation, as signs as well for um, whenever your bearded dragon is at an adult age. So for juvenile dragons, they're going to be fed between one and two times per day, closer to adults. But their diet ratio should be close to 70% protein and 20%, 30% greens. Uh, this means they will need around 30 to 80 crickets, insects, in one day. Um, because they eat less often, now it's, uh, expect to feed them between 15 and 40 crickets in one meal. Uh, again, feed them as much as they'll eat at one time. Uh, this is going to be 10 minutes for younger dragons, 15 minutes for the older ones. And as always, make sure the crickets are smaller than the space between their eyes. So what makes crickets so popular? Crickets make a consistently popular choice with reptiles because of their high protein, easy availability, low fat, and low cost. Crickets have become a staple of the reptile diet, including bearded dragons. Uh, the main goal for live food is to give the pet high amounts of protein and small amounts of fats. Crickets do have a good amount of protein in them. They are also a little low in fat, especially when, if you compare them to most worms. Um, perhaps the biggest reason uh, they remain popular is, al is also their low, low cost and easy availability. Crickets are bought in bulk and at many pet stores or online. They also require very little care and stay alive for quite a while. When compared to other live food, they fit in somewhere in the middle for quality. Other live foods uh, offer more vitamins, hydration, and are higher in protein, but they also are more expensive. So bearded dragons also like the taste of them, and the crickets are fun to chase and catch for the reptiles. Let's briefly talk about dead crickets. Uh, so no, do not feed bearded dragons dead crickets. Although the reptiles that will eat them, eat them, depending on the level of decomposition, they may make your bearded dragon severely sick. Uh, so although dead crickets may look acceptable to you, it can hurt uh, your pet no matter how fresh you know it may be. Uh, this is also why we recommend removing any food in the tank after a specified feeding time, that 10 or 15 minute window. Uh, any leftover crickets could die and then spell disaster for your pet. So along the same lines, never leave old greens inside the tank either. These can cause damage as well. So healthy diets. When we talk about proteins in this section, we're referring to all the any live food or slash insect. Veg are uh, further broken down into vegetations, vegetables, and fruits. Baby and juvenile bearded dragons need more protein, which is why the previous sections also suggested more crickets, that 70% protein ratio to 30% vegetables. Um, they need the extra calories to grow and gain mass to protect themselves from predators. So adult bearded dragons don't need this. They need to get more vitamins to help their bodies run smoother and healthier over the long run. This is why adult bearded dragons uh, diets consist of fewer proteins and more greens. It's actually going to be a complete swap. It'll go 30% protein, 70% vegetables um, at bearded dragon maturity or in their adult age. So younger bearded dragons eat more often than adults do, and this is also because protein is easier for bearded dragons to burn through. So here's a great diet table you can either take a screenshot of or come back and view at any time. Uh, uh, here I give you the age, the diet ratio, the amount of uh, insects, and then the frequency of their feedings. So you can either pause this video, take an image, and uh, this, is a, this is an exact uh, table that I go by when feeding bearded dragons. So I hope you enjoyed learning about how many crickets to feed your bearded dragon. The answer is really a little unclear, but if you follow the right feeding procedure and frequency, they'll eat only what they need. Uh, a good rule of thumb is the 10 to 20 crickets in one day for adults, 30 to 80 for baby and juvenile bearded dragons. If you want to learn more about bearded dragons and become the best pet owner you really can be, I've written a digital handbook on bearded dragons that covers everything from A to Z. Check it out. There's a link in the description if that's something you're interested in and you're highly uh, motivated about the bearded dragon. Thanks for watching our video. I hope you learned something new. While you're here, please comment below, like this video, and subscribe to our channel.
Thanks for watching. Until the next one. Subscribe yet? Have you subscribed yet? Subscribe yet?